Uh, my name is Dis Costa. I'm a development, development economist and I work in a consultancy company in Mozambique. The name is Austral Kaui. It's a, a company with, uh, working with AIDS research for uh, many years, more than 10 years. And I've been involved in several, several of these works Austral has been undertaking in Mozambique. Uh, I got involved in this project with CGD because, okay, CGD approached Austral to undertake the study and being one of the consultants with expertise in, in research in Austral and also in policy research, I got involved in this type of work. Uh, I think uh, in Mozambique, AIDS is one of the most serious epidemic we have. We have a high prevalence rate. The last figures uh, that have been uh, presented this year, it's around 70% in prevalence rate, uh, more serious in the center of the country. And uh, so, uh, and because of this, Mozambique has received in the last years uh, some million dollars from several donors, particularly uh, Global Fund, World Bank, and Pepfar. We feel daily the, the seriousness of this disease. Having colleagues in the office that tell us stories about relatives dying of AIDS, orphans taking care of families at home because their elder relatives died, orphans being taken care by grandparents because the father and the mother died, uh, companies where the employees important managerial capacities that are being uh, just, uh, I cannot say in English, that is being highly reduced because the manager died. You listen to stories of university students and actually you see on the newspaper in the op op ops to how do you say in English? Obituaries. You see uh, students from the university informing of colleagues dying, and we know that there is a specific word that says, victim of illness is the expression normally people put in the obituaries to inform that someone died. So we see every day. I myself, I have two employees that one died with AIDS, and the other one, uh, and the other one now he has tuberculosis, but the basis is AIDS. So, actually, is is a very serious problem that we are in our daily life. We see people infected, knowing about infected people and about affected people, and there are some cultural practices in Mozambique that I don't know if you in the States know but they've contributed highly for that. Uh, so they are, I can refer mainly to the alcoholism that is not so spoken, but in Mozambique there is this male society where the men on Fridays go just for enjoy himself, drinks a lot, have any type of social strata, and he, and he has sex with different partners. So this is one of the very important forms of the simulation of the disease. So I think with these examples I'm just trying to show how we feel daily the disease. In terms of, of why it's important for the United States and for you American citizens, I think finally we are a global world. Uh, all the communication systems we have in place, we listen from Obama and Hillary, in the, in the television and you listen about Africa and everybody dying from AIDS. So just as an individual, I think it's an interesting topic. Secondly, your president just started this Hep Fire initiative to support all these countries affected by AIDS. And because this money is yours, so I think, because the money that you're giving to us in the third world comes from your taxes, I think it's on your interest to know if your money is used properly and is contributing actually to the reduction of the disease.